I said hi. <laughs> For those of you who don't know me, my name is Mariah or Mia, it's my channel name. Um, my my initials are MIA. My name isn't actually Mia, it is Mariah. Um, it's just my my first, middle, and last initial literally spell out Mia, so that's where I got my channel name from. But my name is Mariah, like the singer, spelled the same and everything. No, I can't sing. Please don't ask me to sing because I can't. Um, yeah, you can call me either. I don't really have a preference. Like most people I know in my life call me Mariah, but you know, call me either. It's your world. <laughs> um, I don't really know what this video is going to be or what it's going to turn into, how people are going to react. I know what it's not though. It's not ASMR and I don't know how I'm going to put that in the title, but you know, hopefully you'll figure it out. I don't know. <laughs> it's just really weird making a video and not whispering, but this is my real speaking voice and the sun is like right there. So, um... You know, feel free to click out of this video. I'm kind of just going to be talking. Um, I don't really know what sparked me to do a video like this. I think it's just the fact that I hit 30k and I haven't really been processing it. That's a lot of people. 30,000 is a lot of people. Of course not like compared to other people that I, that I like watch, but to me this is still a lot. And I kind of feel like now that I have this semi medium-ish big platform i could use it to spread more positivity because lord knows we need more of it so that's that's kind of why i'm doing this um and kind of because i don't really talk about myself a whole lot on my channel i kind of just i kind of just whisper so <laughs> that's that's kind of why i'm i'm making this video i guess i don't need this ring light anymore jesus um, and there's just, there's a whole lot going on and just, I want people to, moral of this video is I want people to feel like this, my channel is a safe space for everyone, people of different races, people who follow different religions, different sexual orientations, any kind of community you're a part of. I accept everyone. I don't judge anyone based off of the choices that they make or the life that they live. I, I try not to judge people. I'm not perfect, but I, I do feel like everyone has a story and me, I'm in no position to judge anybody the way I look at it. I feel like, you know, everyone goes through things. So what's, what's wrong with finding comfort or finding safety in something like ASMR? So people make it out to be a joke and it's always like the butt of the joke and you know i tried asmr and then, then it's just terrible but <laughs> like like purposely like for comical matters but you know you get what i'm trying to say so yeah um sorry about the sun she isn't really rocking with me right now and that's fine there's a lot going on in the world right now not all of it is great and I, um, and I, I realize now that I have a platform where I can spread more positivity just because, you know, people need it. The positive affirmation videos do more for, for us than, than people realize. Like going to sleep, hearing someone talking about how important you are and how much you matter like actually does way more than than people realize it's something about it's something about like writing things down and hearing things repeated that makes it actually stick with you so that is why they're one of my favorite videos to watch and listen to because they they help me and i'm like i said i'm not perfect i go through things too that's why i haven't been on youtube for five six days because I go through things and when I'm making these videos, I feel it very necessary for my own mental health to take a break because some people on this app are just so mean and I am a small little human being with feelings and I don't like being told mean things. Although like I don't care and I don't like lose sleep over it, it's still like it can, it can get to you a little bit. Like um... Like, I knew what I was getting into when I decided to move my content from Instagram over to YouTube. Because a lot of you may not know this, but I started 
making ASMR videos. I started making one minute ASMR videos on Instagram. I would sit in my bathroom or in my room or wherever I wanted to sit at my camera and I would make little videos. Sometimes it would, the camera would be focused on something else. Sometimes it would just be me from like here down. <laughs> I wouldn't show my face. And then I was like, then I discovered ASMR on YouTube and I was like, I wanna do this, I think I do, yeah. <laughs> so that's why I'm like in such shock that it turned into what it turned into <laughs> i'm not like acting any kind of way like this is genuinely how i am i'm really like fidgety and i can't like always focus on the camera so <laughs> people are like right why are you looking at the camera <laughs> look at the camera and I, I i do try um that's why i i just want everyone to feel like they belong somewhere if you don't feel like you belong where you're at now you can belong here and that's super cheesy and super corny i know but i i do i do want everyone to feel like they're accepted and they're worthy of love and life and just it doesn't matter who you decide to love outside of your race outside of your gender like it doesn't matter like you are accepted and valid and important and worthy and you belong here like i feel like everyone is put here for a reason and i think the more good people do like the better off we'll all be like the world's not perfect i know that it's not gonna be perfect but just spewing just absolute garbage is not gonna do anything for anybody except more garbage being spewed so i i honestly like can't like tell like i can't give a reason why i'm making this video i just feel like i think i've said that a lot like i don't know why i'm making but i don't i really don't but i I knew like I knew what I was getting into when I decided that I was going to move over to YouTube. I've had some of the worst things ever said to me said like on this app and it is like it's bad. And it doesn't it doesn't bother me, you know. I've had people make racist comments, homophobic comments, all that great stuff telling me that I'm copying someone else or I want to be like someone else. I'm I'm very content with who I am inside my sexuality and and my race and I've been you know I love making these videos like ASMR not like I love making these videos and I'm I'm not trying to be like anybody else there's only so many ways I can whisper <laughs> so you know I always encourage people who don't like my videos to watch other people's videos I hope that I'm making at least a little bit of sense. I'm not trying to make people believe what I believe. I'm trying to get people to understand that everyone's situation is different and there are people who are going through things right now who find like safety and comfort in these videos and I think that these videos are like important and i and i i wanted to make this to thank people who support me regardless of the fact that like you know they may think i'm trying to be someone else or i'm doing this for whatever reason they think i just want everyone to understand that my main purpose of these videos is so that people feel safe like having people tell me that my videos have helped them in any way like means more to me than what asmr hater one two three had to say you know <laughs> that was very like off the top and didn't make any sense but that's how i picture it like I'm, like just with everything that's going on in the world i feel like people need a safe space it doesn't have to be like asmr videos it doesn't have to be mine it doesn't have to be asmr at all it could be anything it could be literally anything and i want to be known as someone who like respects and appreciates everyone i i love constructive criticism i love it you know the the nice one not you should quit asmr because you suck at it i don't like those comments i like the the constructive ones that can help better my channel not try to get me to quit but yeah that's that's the whole reason i make these videos because i i know what these videos can do for people asmr i feel like i have to keep saying it not these videos specifically but asmr videos in general i know what they can do for people because they've done that for me when i was at very very low 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 when i was at a very low point in my life and i don't want 
to ever go back to that point and I don't want anyone else to feel like they need to be at their lowest I want everyone to feel like they have someone to talk to that's why I'm always replying to messages and I'm always talking to people and replying to comments and people are always like oh my gosh I can't believe you replied and it's it's so weird like being treated like like I'm famous like that's so crazy to me <laughs> that's so weird because I don't feel like it I feel like you know I just make YouTube videos they've been making when I go on these like rants and I don't write anything down I'm just speaking how I feel I feel like I'm not really making sense but I always hope and pray that I'm somewhat making a little bit of sense that's that's what I always hope for that I'm at least making a little bit of sense to someone <laughs> um I just wanted everyone to see how like how I really am and how I really feel about these kinds of videos and I'm not sad or upset or anything it's just there's a lot going on in the world right now and the following like the recent events that happened in New Zealand um I one of my best one of my best friends in the entire world is Muslim and I adore her and her being scared makes her being scared and upset makes me scared and upset and like she gets bullied sometimes you know she's the same age as me she's 20 years old and she goes out into the world and there are people that like just stare at her and d just don't like her just because of her religion and i think that is very upsetting to me and so when things like that happen i want i don't want her to feel like she isn't worthy of life and love and she isn't accepted of anywhere like I don't know who out there has gone through the same thing um, but I want this to be like a general like safe space for people who don't feel like they're worth you know love and life <laughs> so yeah I don't judge I accept and love everyone as they come and I don't care what you look like or what religion you follow or who you decide to love i accept everyone and i want everyone to feel like they're accepted if not from the people around you then know that you're accepted by me and i know that doesn't mean much because i'm literally someone you've never met <laughs> but you are you're very valid and very important and you, you <laughs> and you matter you do you you matter and you're worthy of everything because you matter and your life matters and you shouldn't be scared to be I feel like this is like a lifetime movie but no seriously you <laughs> you are worthy of so much more than you may think and you should not be scared to live your truth live who you know you are and you know you have the potential to be something great and the thoughts and the opinions of someone else shouldn't dictate what you do with your life pray to whoever you want to pray to or don't pray if you don't believe in anything love who you want to love if it's the opposite gender the same gender inside your race outside of your race you know who who gives up no i'm just kidding <laughs> who cares no but seriously who cares like i this world is so judgmental and people can be so judgmental and i just i was always always raised to be like from like like babies we were as children we were always told treat people the way you want to be treated be if you want people to be nice be nice to them and that's that's not always the case but because that's not always the case because some people are just not nice but it is important that we spread more love and because i have 30,000 of you watching me now i want that message to get out there as far as it can go this sounds like i know it sounds like a hallmark movie a lifetime movie but <laughs> It's, this is the truth. This is the entire reason I make these videos. And th I want as many people to hear these words as possible because some people might not be told enough how much they matter and how important that they are. And if you 
need to hear it from a complete stranger, a 20 year old girl who makes ASMR videos in her bedroom, then so be <laughs> Like I said, I have no idea what this video, like, it's just me talking and it took a lot of courage for me to say this. I don't, the last thing I want is for this video to be controversial, 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 controversial. I want everyone to listen to what I'm saying and understand that they, I want everyone to just take the words that I'm saying and know that they are important. I, I want everyone who watches this video to somewhat understand that whatever they're going through, this can be like a safe space for them. Whatever it is you're going through, this can be a place you come to like for comfort, for relaxation, whatever it is that you need, you can, ha you can get that here. If you need to forget something, if you need to just take a break, a mental break those are very much needed I'm on a mental break right now <laughs> I think you should take it if you need it then take it please because mental health is just as important as physical health and everyone needs it everyone needs a mental day or three mental days I'm taking 14 mental days <laughs> but again that's that's fine that's perfectly fine that's okay um, blinded i hope that you guys um enjoyed this video i hope that my goofiness wasn't too goofy and i hope the sun didn't blind you i'm filming this at like five in the evening so <laughs> yeah um i'm here to talk to anyone who needs it. I'm not a licensed therapist. I'm not saying that things are going to get better as soon as you wake up in the morning or as soon as you go to sleep, you're going to wake up and everything's going to be fine because I know that's not how it works, but I've been through enough to know that other people go through things too and just the the advice you give someone, any kind of positive advice you give someone can go such a long long way. So, my Instagram is in the description of every single one of my videos let's just you know if you can't talk to a complete stranger talk to someone if you need it talk to someone you trust there are actual therapists that you can text that you can talk to if you need it if you feel like you really truly need it or talk to your best friend your girlfriend your boyfriend your parents <laughs> Talk to anyone who will listen. I seriously encourage you to. Seriously. Seriously. <laughs> How do you do an outro to a video like this? Peace out, Girl Scout. That was bad. Um, bye.